there are lots of websites and uh, YouTube videos that demonstrate how to determine the width of a human hair uh, using a common laser pointer and I'm not going to revisit that you can uh, see those online what I thought would be interesting was to determine the accuracy of even a inexpensive cat toy laser pointer you can see that this one does not have a specific wavelength uh, but uh, a range from 630 to 670 nanometers that doesn't mean that it has a specific wavelength somewhere in there and they just didn't measure it it simply means that these inexpensive laser diodes uh, are not perfectly coherent so for the purposes of my experiment I chose a median wavelength of 650 nanometers for all calculations of hair diameter before each hair is measured using the laser diffraction method each one is taped to a glass slide and uh, its actual diameter is determined by a calibrated micrometer this example is a hair from my head as seen through the camera and using a measurement tool with the camera software I'm able to accurately measure the diameter of each hair as you can see here from a graph of my data the laser measurements were surprisingly accurate with a maximum error of 7.56 percent and an average error of only 4.38 percent overall this data shows that just about any cheap laser pointer will give relatively accurate results for determining the diameter of hair